Greetings viewers and welcome back to Just Short of Fantastic. Today I have a super special one short day for you because I am on a cruise. And not just any cruise, but a Disney cruise. It's just after 6 in the morning, but I want to go running as the sun comes up. And I'm going to take you with me. One short day in the Emerald City. Korea look good, but I saw the sunrise, sort of, in a manner of speaking. Ah, there it is, that cloudless Caribbean sunrise. Well, not entirely cloudless, but it looks pretty good now. Mm. This is Animator's Palette, and this is where we'll be having dinner tonight. Oh, I have been looking forward to it, like, for the last three days. I'm so excited. Here we are on deck three. I'm heading to O'Gill's Pub because they're having a talk called Disney Innovations Theme Parks. I do love theme parks. And I do love Disney. I do love Disney theme parks. So I'm very excited about this talk. Uh, I really, really, really enjoy it. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying your time here on board as well. This presentation was designed specifically for the Disney magic. Okay, so without further ado, Disney Innovations. Although there are dozens of small innovations over the five decades of Disney parks, a group of Disney experts and historians have offered their ideas and opinions for this, our countdown of the top innovations in the field of Disney parks and resorts. We made it into a world-class family entertainment. Our number 10 innovation is actually Disneyland itself. Now, let's take a look at this park ticket here. $2.50 for an adult to enjoy Disneyland. At those prices, it's truly the most magical place on earth. <laughs> okay? Yes. Um, so we're gonna move on <laughs> uh, to our number one innovation. Our final innovation in Disney parks and resorts was a project that started the resort part. Uh, Walt Disney's last big dream is our top innovation. So number one is the Destination Resort. And we have a video clip from like the 70s with like, I'll just let you see it. <laughs> it's really cool. <laughs> All right, here we go. Hello, everyone. I'm Julie Andrews, and I'm here at the opening of the Walt Disney World in Florida, just a few miles away from Cape Kennedy, where men point their space vehicles toward the stars. Walt Disney decided to launch his final dream. commitment to the future for your children and mine. Best of all, it is a place to stir the imagination and instill a sense of hope for tomorrow. A joyful land built by an inspired dreamer for other dreamers and dreams still to come. The time, now. Occasion, the opening of Walt Disney World. The place, Orlando, Florida. The grand opening of Walt Disney World. Starring Julie Andrews. That video was life. Oh. <laughs> I first saw that, I was in tears. say to me, Christy, what's the best part of a Disney cruise? I would say the music. You big neighbor, you ain't never had a friend, never had a friend, you ain't had a friend, never you ain't never had a friend like me. You ain't never had a friend like me. Obviously, but the food is a very close second, followed by the fact that you never know who you'll find just around the corner. At last, the moment I've been waiting for all day has arrived dinner in the animator's palette. Yes! 
My Disney Cruise Line dream has come true. I am inside Canada Palace. It's so amazing. Look at it. Oh my gosh. So everything starts out black and white. And as the meal progresses, you'll see it come to life. One with a nice chop. Get ready, honey. It's going crazy now. short day Disney Cruise Line and stay just short of fantastic.